Hello all, um, back at you again with uh, more uh, Arch Linux and uh, Compiz Fusion um, uh, standalone. And I think I found a more uh, complete um, or comprehensive uh, way of approaching this. And uh, of course I made some notes. Now there's a, there's a bunch of uh, files you have to download through Yawart, the, the user repository. Uh, none of this is supported by uh, Arch Linux. And uh, hopefully the uh, <clears throat> repository uh, will be retained for a while for these files. So under the notes, uh, I'll upload this uh, so you can look at it. So make sure you have uh, Pac-Man installed if you haven't. Uh, that is, you know, pseudo Pac-Man, capital S, Yawart. And then these files, Yawart, and then the comp is uh, settings manager, and these other ones one at a time. And uh, they will take a while to compile and download. And if you uh, choose this one, the main genie, it I, no, I think I noticed that it installed this one, VCOP. And if it does, and if uh, you see this message, Compass Fusion plugins main is a conflict, just hit yes to remove it. It doesn't seem to affect it. And then continue on installing the other plugins. And then Fusion Icon, and then still in your art, uh, Emerald, not Emerald JIT, just straight Emerald, it's still there, and Emerald Dash Themes. And the uh, simplest way is uh, if you don't have any other uh, systems installed, desktop environments, or uh, login managers, is just to edit your X init RC file. If you don't have that in your home directory, uh, just copy that from the uh, Etsy SKEL directory into your home folder and then just uh, fill in what I have as an example. <clears throat> First of all, um, the, the main thing is whatever you have at startup, this is uh, you know your choosing, um, the last entry has to be exec fusion dash icon if you don't uh, it won't start it'll probably just crash or go back to the yeah, it'll just let's go back to the prompt um, however at the very least uh, maybe you have something like tint 2 or a bot window navigator uh, or something like a panel this is tint 2 up here this panel here okay and the one I'm using is uh, you can get this through Pac-Man Tint 2, but the uh, one I'm using is through uh, Yawart. So we'll do, uh, I'll show you what I mean. Yawart Tint 2. See, it's in the community, but I'm using Tint 2-SVN uh, because it uh, enables uh, quite a bit more functionality than just the basic one, okay? Now, if you do uh, have other um, desktop environments, uh, all is not lost. Um, you can still do this. Um, for example, I have uh, XFCE 4, uh, OpenBox, and GNOME Shell, GNOME 3 uh, running, different desktop managers. And all you have to do is just have to edit, create a new file under this directory here, USR Share X Sessions. We'll open a terminal and list out this USR. Uh, sessions directory and as you can see here there's GNOME, OpenBox, SFC, oh, I forgot about uh, Xbox Media Center, XBMC and GNOME Classic but uh, the one I made is called fusion.desktop now the first part of it before the dot you can call it compiz.desktop or whatever uh, but make sure you have the dot desktop at the end so if we change to that directory And then we do like a pseudo G edit leaf pad nano whatever you want edit say G edit uh, fusion dot desk top. You have to put these entries in. Just copy and paste from the notes here. Uh, the main thing is uh, the exact line is pointing to that dot X in an RC to run uh, at startup. Um, you save that, okay, save the file, make sure you sudo run it as a 
edit it as root and save that then you can log in uh, log out um, sorry you can start your uh, say you have GDM and you're in uh, another session log out and this entry whatever you named it it could be called comp is should be there I can't show you because if I log out then uh, no more video now how do you log out um, there's no restart uh, there's no shutdown that's one of the drawbacks but if you click the fusion icon up here right click it says quit and if you have a login manager such as GDM you'll see that open up again and you can choose from whatever desktop environments you have installed um, later on I'll show you how a simple way to uh, get a reboot and a shutdown um, menu if you want but this should get you started um, with uh, Compass standalone in Arch Linux.